Thank you very much, gentlemen. Great cast on the day. I am joined by the Immortals cat, as we had quite a cat fight between Immortals and Energy just a few minutes ago. I'm joined by Rainover after their victory, 4-0 now, and 24 consecutive victories for Rainover and Hooney in the regular split. So these guys just keep mounting wins. Congratulations on that little feat. I have to ask you, towards the end of the game, Rainover, things were looking a little scary as you tried to get into the base. What was going on? What were the communications for the team? What do you mean going on the base? When you were trying to break the base and then you saw Impact come in and Impact started fighting onto Wild Turtle, and what was kind of the communication when things got scary? I don't remember that situation. What <laughs> no worries, no worries, no worries. We'll make it simpler. What were you guys kind of thinking as you were trying to get into the base, when you were trying to beat energy? Um, like at the like end of the game, like we pretty much know that if we just engage, if we fight, we're going to win the game. So. Like, they just stayed in a bit, and then there was no tower, so we just dived them. So I think we pretty much everyone knew that we are going to win the game. Right, yeah. Super simple. You guys were going in very strong the whole time. And I actually want to kind of talk about that. Where's the communication on the team coming from? Who's leading? Who's calling the shots mostly? Mm, I think, like, for our team, like, like there's, like, like we do our like communication, like, for, like, everyone. Mm -hmm. But, like, certain guys, like, are, like, good at some kind of certain thing, like for example, like someone is good at calling Nash, someone is good at like TP engage, someone is good at like the rotation. So like, everyone like give their opinion and then if everyone just talk each other and then we just choose what like every, everyone thinks that is the best, you know? It, it seemed to be working out well. Everybody's saying that the team has clicked. You guys work together amazingly. You're 4-0 now, rain over. Do you think Immortals can go undefeated in the NALCS? Um, when I was playing Athletic, like when I was playing LCS match, uh, like even though like we are behind, like we just think like, oh, I think I don't think we're gonna lose this game, you know, because enemy was not making so much plays, and then we just had to wait until they make mistake, and then I think it's, I feel pretty much, same at here at NA, and then, like I, even though like we are behind, like even yesterday against TSM, like we didn't really feel that we're gonna lose the game, even though we're super behind. And then we just wait until they make mistakes. So like I think it's gonna be pretty much. I just feel pretty much same. Okay. When I wasn't at Atlantic, so I think maybe. Well, you guys make it look so easy. Congratulations on the win, and best of luck in the rest of the season as you guys head on 4-0, the only team now in the NALCS. Right now, we're gonna throw it to the analyst desk to break down the rest of that game.